Hello, I felt it was time to give an update on my Bachman Thomas videos. Since the year is halfway through and I have not actually finished any of the things that I said that I had hoped to get at least one of done. However, I have been making progress. The projects I said I'd be working on were an abridged version of Duck and the Diesel Engine, a full version of Pop Goes the Diesel, which I filmed a few years ago but never edited altogether, as well as redoing a couple of older Bachman videos that I felt needed updates. So anyway, I've almost finished editing the Pop Goes the Diesel video. I just need to add a few sound effects, and it should be done within the next couple weeks. And uh, I've actually filmed uh, one scene of uh, the abridged version of Pop Goes the Diesel. One video that could use a bit of an update, since I haven't made an update of it for five years, is the videos I have made in the past that show how much the Bachman line has grown since it began 15 years ago. The trouble I'm having with this video is, uh, well, I've been having multiple problems. One is that not all items have lasted throughout the years, a number of them have been discontinued, so just wondering what to do about those that have been discontinued. I was thinking of possibly putting some sort of temporary mark on them to indicate that they didn't that they were discontinued starting from that particular year. Anyway, if you wondered what videos I'm talking about, about the Bachman Progress videos, uh, I'll, I'll add some links to the, in the description. But uh, anyway, another issue that I've had is uh, uh, some items were uh, announced, but took a year, or in the case of Oliver, two years before they were actually finished. And the third issue is, due to not really having the time and budget to spend as much time and money on Bachman items as I used to, I actually have, I don't have all of the items that exist, I don't have any of the resin buildings, and uh, the only, uh, I don't have any of the new trucks that were released last year, besides uh, Troublesome Truck number 5. I don't have the, uh, salt wagon or the, uh, Great Western cattle wagon, I think. And I think it was the Great Western van or the live lobsters. I think those were all the ones that were released. And see, that's saying the fact that I don't know off the top of my head exactly which items were made. So that's another thing. So I'm sort of not quite sure how to go about doing the, uh, Bachman video of showing the progress of Bachman items. And lastly, the uh, nap food train spotting video, which again, if you wish to know what I'm talking about, uh, I'll put a link in this, the description. One thing about that is it's, uh, looking back on the video, it is actually kind of stressing me out to that the timetable I set up could use some improvements, especially since uh, uh, I made that timetable before Sir Topham Hat on his Twitter account. Wonderful account, you should, uh, I suggest if you're on Twitter following it. Again, I'll add a link to the description. Anyway, I made the timetable before Sir Topham Hat posted the timetable for Tidmouth. But I'm having difficulty figuring out exactly how to rearrange the timetable. And because of this, and because not all uh, engines I've made by Bachman uh, seem, to me, they don't, well, a few of them don't seem likely to actually go through an app food station. I'm thinking of, instead of doing a full train spotting video that includes the timetable, I was thinking of instead making a couple of instrumental music videos. One is of Nap food station, and the other is of Brendam Docks, both times just showing various characters going in and out with various trains. I think between those two locations I'll cover all the characters. Except perhaps Harry and Bert, and uh, I probably will find some excuse to uh, have them pass through, even if I just do what the series does where they just pass through to, to entice Diesel to be a jerk. So yeah, that's about it.
Thank you for watching. So long.